Okay. Hello everyone and welcome back to Finn's Layout. Um, today we're going to do a tracing video because I promised that in the Season 1 trailer. So here we are with the tracing video. Um, this is a, a pack by Bossman Games, uh, which is a rebuilt Merchant Navy. This is my personal favourite. We are on the Falmouth branch line, as you can see. Uh, and this is like how the Navy would have looked back in the late 60s. As you can see, it has no nameplate at all. It's gone, as you can see there. Um, but Busman Games have really outdone themselves this time on this one. It's just a beautiful, beautiful engine. And they've just made it look amazing with all this weathering. So, um, what we're going to do... We're pretty much just going to go from Falmouth um, to to uh, Penamir platform, I think it's called, and then back to Falmouth again. So it's just going to be a cute little round trip kind of thing, just small, quick, just to see if you guys like this content, and if you do, um, we'll do more. So my videos on Train Simulator are going to be based in Falmouth or the Isle of Wight, my two favourite railways in the world, and uh, yeah. So let's get straight into this, so uh, we'll get the express lights on, and we will get some headboards. Now this pack does come with headboards, and it comes with other trains, this is just my personal favourite. And my favourite headboard is the British Pullman, but they don't have it on this one. I don't know why... I don't, it comes with all the others, but for some reason it's not on mine. So my second favourite is the Bournemouth Bell, but we're not in Bournemouth. So let's do um, the Strong Countryman there, because we are in the country. And here's the harbour, as you can see. Uh, let's get the passengers on give a little toot to say we're nearly ready <laughs> details are just amazing we'll leave the window open because it looks quite hot out there so we'll leave that open a bit as you can see unlike train simulator it does actually leave the window Crack it open as you can see. Okay, so we're all ready and set to go. Okay, right, everyone's on. Let's give a cut to. And away we go. Oh. Got to put the reverser on forward. Let's do it. Right, let's go. If the game does lag a bit, it's not the add on, it's um, my screen recorder. It just looks amazing.
So we're nearing the platform now, as you can see. We'll start to slow down uh, when we hit 40. Cab detail is just amazing. Just, I don't know what to say, it's just so good. It has to be one of the best train add-ons you can get. It's going to be hard to beat this. It is currently 4 minutes past 12 at night, if you can see that. Can you see that? Can you see that? Yep. Slowly approaching the top one now. It's my favourite whistle, that little branch line on that. It's really good. Um, by the way guys, I'm not going to put any editing into this video because it takes it takes at least a full day to transfer this onto my phone, even if it is a short clip. Because my phone's getting old and it's not got any storage, so I can't. So I'm not going to bother editing it. Uh, I will add a thumbnail, but we're going to skip editing, so sorry if I make any mistakes in advance. You can correct me in the comment section. Slowly does it. Are we in? No, we're not. We need the short train for this, really. This is more of an express train. We've even got the express lights on. I've forgotten what the stopping train lights are. I might have to have a quick look. Look at what the passenger train lights are now, and then I can quickly, well, stopping train now, and I can quickly do it now. Uh, two seconds, guys. Here we go. I did download the manual for this and I'm just trying to find it now. So, uh, yeah. Got ya, right. 
Uh, no, no, no. Yes, that's the stopping passenger train. Right then, open the doors. Yeah, a couple. A whistle. And off we go. Wonder what they are. I could do with a cup of tea right now, actually. the point let's go reverse 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 As far as detail goes, it's just amazing. I mean, they've even got the little company name there. Just so good. So good. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, a bit too fast. Should have really done this actually. Okay. I think that's a modern light anyway. Yeah, it is. I wouldn't have had those in the 60s, but oh well. Jeez, are we going to stop anytime soon? Oh, excuse the quarantine hair, by the way. I haven't had, a, I had the sides done. But I'm not showing you that, hence so why I got the bandana on. Be approaching the coaches now. Yeah. It's 
probably isn't the best chainsaw video in the world, but it certainly isn't the worst. So I apologise if it's a bit shit. You know. Lovely. Don't know how you get the tender lights on. Because I've only, only just this only came out like three days ago. So uh, I'm yet to figure that out guys. If anyone knows, please do tell me. love this branch line. If you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, and uh, I'll do more and I will do the full branch line. But this is just kind of like a, a sneak peek or like uh, how did I do kind of video if you want more of this. So if you want to find out the rest of the branch line, because there is loads more to discover, we are only here and we can still go all the way from there, from there all the way to there. If you want me to discover that then uh, like, subscribe, comment. Don't have to comment but I can subscribe. Right, put the reverser in reverse. Quick toot. And away we go. These coaches don't come with the pack by the way, these are separately bought items of mine. I think some of them came with the A4. If I guess correctly. Hmm. Might do an A4 review. On this uh, train simulator we're going to have steam galas, diesel galas, all will be held on the Falmouth branch line or the Isle of Wight. I haven't decided which one I like more yet. There's probably more room on the Falmouth branch line but then um, the Isle of Wight looks cool because you've got the pier and all that so let me know in the comments below uh, and we'll find out which one. Uh, next video probably will be a steam or diesel gala. Uh, the, uh, again comment uh, which one you'd rather have, so steam or diesel? Personally, I love, love, love steam and I love it, but personally, I prefer diesel because honestly, it's easier to drive. That's, that's the reason why. Real life, I don't know, but on train sim, diesel because it's easier to drive. But you know, which one do you want? Uh, comment and all that, and uh, we'll see. We'll see. So we're just approaching Falmouth now. I'll just start to slow down. Normally if you approach a terminus, uh, then you go fully into the station, you'd stop and then like an airway or something would come and shunt your carriages away, you'd turn around on the turntable, then you'd, the, the O8 would put the coaches back and that would go into the sidings and then uh, the process would happen again, you'd back up to your carriages and away you'd go. So just a nice little fact there for you. Also, the, uh, they were all dirty and all that, uh, the Merchant Navy classes, because um, they were being scrapped in like a few months and they took the nameplates off to save those because they were worth a lot of money and they were scared that teenagers like myself would come and nick them and all that. Uh, so they took them off and you just left with the number and all that before they were scrapped. Unfortunately, they uh, scrapped quite a lot, even though it's a beautiful class. Uh, but we have got some preserved, we've got some normal ones and some rebuilt ones, so it's not too bad overall, to be honest, so, uh, yeah. 
Oh no, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. Get a feeling we're not going to stop in time, guys. I might have done this a bit over here. We might do. Stop. going on here. Okay, we just stopped. We didn't crash. Look, see, we just stopped in time. Anyway, let's uh, let the passengers out. I have got an 08 on this railway actually. I could try and do that. It'd be a bit of a faff. Should we try? Let's give it a try. Okay. I think what this would do is have a look where we're going. Oh, stop there. So we're coming in now. Looks okay. So we need to get to that line there. That um, that third line. See if we can do this. I've never really done a shooting challenge before. This is new. has to be one of my favourite diesel shunters. Well, I think my favourite is the Rustin shunter. The little Rush Rustin 48. That tiny one. Just because of its size and everything. There's probably an easier way to do this, but... Um, Perfect. Let's go. I think it's perfect anyway. Also comment what other trains you can see on the, the video as well, that'd be nice if you guys want that. If you guys like that, I should have said. Okay, up there, up there. Okay, right, let's go. speed of these things of the O8 is 15 so I don't know why train sim has made it go faster. I'll try and keep it realistic.
Whoa! What happened there? I didn't hit it that hard. Well, I suppose that's the end of that. Uh, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Uh, I was surprised that that trailer got 7 or 8 likes, so thank you. That's uh, It's not a lot really, but it's a big achievement for me. So, um, thank you for watching, and I'll uh, see you guys later. Bye now. Oh, also, I'll just quickly run through what trains I have. Uh, my favourite train in the world, don't ask why, is the 153. Uh, so I might do a video on that, on the Diesel Gala. We might do a Diesel Gala first. Uh, but these are all the trains that I've got. So I'll just run through them. Uh, these are all the different Merchant Navy. So you got the black, the blue, clean green, uh, the clan line one, no name, and with name. Uh, yep. Yeah. 9F, my uh, favourite steam engine, Evening Star at the moment but it might change because I do like the Merchant Navy quite a lot but at the moment the Evening Star uh, Bubble Car, that's quite an odd one but it's quite cool got some modern ones like the 68 and all that the 395 oh I got a lot of Pacifics my favourite is Sir Nigel Grizzly or Grizzly whatever you call him I uh, got some uh, miniature railway stuff, light railway stuff, narrow gauge, whatever you like to call it. So we could have like a narrow gauge gala day if you guys want that. And the Intercity 125. Oh, we got Flying Scotsman as well. And she comes in all those different colours. Um. Oh, and we got Big Boy, but I'm not a big American fan, so not a lot. Tornado there, as you can see as well. So, yeah, um. I'll show you my roots as well. These are all my roots, but my favourite is Isla, Isla White on the Farmer's Branch Line. So we'll probably have the gala on the Isla White because I've got loads of sidings and all that. Um, but I'll look forward to seeing you then. Thank you all. Again, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Thanks for watching. Bye now.